So then he looks me dead in the eye and says, any last words? And? And I say, the aristocrats. I don't get it. Well, maybe you had to be there. Well, I'm sorry, but I was a little bit busy dealing with a doomsday device. Honestly, who builds a super weapon in Belgium? Excuses, excuses. Still wish we could stay behind a while. I've never seen so much chocolate. Are you paying attention? You seem like you're not paying attention. Sorry, I was just... Hang on. Can you hear that? No. I can't hear anything. Yeah. No bird song. Don't you think that's a bit... Well, a bit strange? I guess? It's a forest on Earth. There should be birds. That's how forests work, Nora. Forests don't always... I'm rounding up, okay? Okay, jeez. That little vein is popping up in your head again. You, your blood pressure must... Oh, crap. What? What is it? You know those weird feelings I get sometimes? Yeah? It's screaming at me to get back to the TARDIS. Yes, well, uh... We should probably listen. What the hell was... Questions like... Oh, run, run, run! <laughs> What's that thing? It was like a man in a horse got fused into some sort of a, a man horse. A skinless man horse. And the smell. I thought I was going to pass out. Um, that would probably be because you were. I've never seen you react like that, which means you've definitely faced this thing before. So, what is it? Readjusted temporal inertia buffers, diverting auxiliary power to shields, and... Hey! talking to you. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. This is just, this is just, this is just more than I can handle, okay? I'm sort of winging it. More than you can handle? What the hell could be more than you can handle? The Night of Orcadia. Abigail Watts. I, Matthew Hopkins, Witchfinder General of this Sceptred Isle, with the authority vested in myself, by myself, have found lawful and just reason to try you for witchcraft. How do you plead? On what grounds? On the grounds of talking back to a man. That doesn't mean I'm a witch. You see? She did it again! <gasps> I am a righteous man, a man of principle, a man of God. All I ask is that you confess to your crimes, and I will be merciful. I don't know what all the fuss is. All I did was help old Wartsworth keep his turnips warm. Liar! I saw a speaking with a weasel! I saw a cavorting with a demon! I saw a reading from a book! This is damning evidence indeed. Do you have any words before I render judgment? Perhaps the names of your satanic sisters? All right, I can do that. Uh, oh, wait, really? I must warn you, though. Their names can bring a chill to the bone and a boil to the blood and can drive a Christian man to madness. I think I'd better write them down for the safety of these fine people. Very well. This should take but a moment, my lord. I thank you for your patience. What is that? It's not a name, you're just drawing a circle. Mother Goddess, hear my plea. I'm Abigail Watts, your magical daughter. Bring me deliverance from this tribulation. I know you will do this for me. As my will, so mote it be. You dare speak the words of the beast? I will strike you down here, witch. Winds from hell themselves. Retreat, retreat from this place.
So, where are we? I, um, I don't know. Oh, great. That never ends badly for us. Yes, well, according to the TARDIS, this is the safest place in the universe for us. I wouldn't be so certain of that. Oh, hi. You, uh, seemed a little tied up there. Need a hand? It'd be nice. Better hurry up, though. Hopkinson's men won't be spooked for long. Hopkins? Nope. I got nothing. Here, let me untie you. Ooh, I have to be honest, I really didn't think that would work. Hey, a little help? What? Oh, right, yeah. That's quite a trick. Save his place in the universe? Uh, the old girl may have rounded it up a little bit. Fuck! The witch has summoned her demons! Kill them! Kill them all! When I say run... Run! <laughs> you don't have to tell me twice. In here, quickly. I'll think twice before entering the old Saxon church. Yeah, it definitely has a vibe. Kinda feel like I'm in some big government building and I'm about to get shot in the head. You know what I mean? I have no idea what any of that means. What's your feeling of the effects of a temporal nexus point? It's a crossroads in time. You speak like a seer. Well, I was Merlin. <laughs> Indeed. Wait, you believe him? Nobody ever believes him. Indeed I do, Nora Watson. How do you know my name? Because I'm a witch. Oh, cool. Is that good? Yeah. Oh, cool? Now you're getting it. Hey, you. Me? Yeah, I have questions. Okay. Dude on horse. Horse dude. Dude horse. Who? Tell now. The Knight of Orcadia, the Enforcer of the Fae, hunts down and punishes those who tamper with the rules of creation. Not a nice guy, all things considered. They are real? That track. <laughs> you angered the Fae. You are a bigger fool than the story suggests, Emrys. That tracks too. Emrys? <laughs> Nobody's called me that in centuries. And when they do, they're usually just trying to show off. Why are you here? Did you come to save me? To save my sisters? Or only to save yourself? Yes, well, you can't say it didn't work out for you, did it? That remains to be seen. Put your superstitions to the side, men. We have a witch in our midst. I need all of you clear-headed, calm, and rational. Oh, great. This guy again. Demons! Take them captive at once! Yes, Mr. Hopkins. Hey, you! Leave her alone! A woman speaking back? You know what that means? She's a witch! Hey! I think we're done here. Ooh, I am the great wizard Greek Y Quad! Look upon me and despair! He's a witch! Silence! Or I shall crush you with a wave of my hand! Nora, have you got the door? Got it. Thank you. And so, we retreat, Emrys. Yeah, sure. Deception! After them, at once! Sir, it's locked! Come on, deeper into the woods! Once we cross that river, we could lose them. Do you have any idea where we're going? You know I don't. Enough of this, Emrys. We are running into folly. Yeah, I'm sure from a distance it looks that way, but... You come down from the stars and stride across my earth, flaunting your power at all who'll give you a moment's attention. That is hauntingly accurate. Look, spare me your judgment. This is a hard job and I try to save as many as I can. And yet, so many are lost in your wake. And not all are lucky enough to be found again. What did you say? The Dread Knight arrives for his quarry. His pale horse has eyes of flame. We can see that! Across the river! Now! How is that gonna help? Listen to him, child! Why isn't it following us? Because it can't. It can't? What do you mean? It... Oh, I get it. It can't cross running water. Such a creature. I've never seen the like of it. I do not like the way it's looking at us. Well, I assume it's looking at us? Kinda hard to tell since it doesn't have eyes or skin. Well, it seems we're at a stalemate, doesn't it? It seems we are, Empress. Wait, you can talk? But you don't have lips! Shouldn't it be all like... Nora, don't be rude. He chased us to the witch trials. I don't owe him a damn thing. Fair enough. So, 
honored hand of the unseen court. What do you want? You have broken the laws of time, and I have been charged to destroy you. Yeah, I've been getting that a lot lately. Yeah, it's getting kind of old. I think I hate it. Me too, actually. Can you two stop disrespecting him? I think he's getting angry. The dragon has eaten its tail. Emrys, you and your companion have until nightfall to render unto me. If you do not, then I will pursue killing and killing and killing until my blade finds your throat. Make your decision swiftly, Emrys. We're not actually going to do that, right? I'm afraid we don't have a choice. Oh, well, uh... It's been a fun ride. Yeah, it has, hasn't it? No. What? No, I will not allow you to surrender. You don't understand. There's nothing else we can do. You can fight. Or lose. And? From what I see, this monster is no different in the core to men like Hopkins. It's near enough certain that one day he will cut me down. But I will not stop fighting. And now, I see the fruits of that fight standing before me. Who? Me? Indeed, Nora. Look into my eyes. Deep, deep, deep into my eyes. What do you see? They look like... like mine. No, child. Yours look like mine. And I am heartened that the daughter I sent away has a future. Oh, that must be why the TARDIS brought us here. The wisdom of the ancestor. Then I trust you lead it? I guess so. We're actually gonna fight it? We're actually gonna fight it. Okay, then let's brainstorm. Does it have any weaknesses? Anything we can take advantage of? No. Well, yes. The running water. It can't stay in our realm while it's exposed to it. But that doesn't help us. Yeah, he didn't seem like the type of guy to trip and fall. That would make it a lot easier, but sadly no. Then what course do we take? Uh, hope it rains? Oh god, I'm gonna die in the witch trials. Over here! We found him! Praise the lord! Oh, come on! Abigail Watts. Demon. You have been found guilty of witchcraft and sentenced in absentia to death by hanging. How do you plead? <laughs> How dare you? Good aim. <laughs> you will pay for that, degenerate slattens. <laughs> Why didn't you yell hi? Because he doesn't deserve it. <laughs> oh, my nose. I think, I think it's broken. Restrain them at once! Of course, Mr. Hopkins. Shame it didn't do us any good. True. But alas, it was worth it. Absolutely. Enough! Mm. Hey, leave him alone! Ooh, you know, he really leaned into that one. I know. That's definitely leaving a mark. Yeah, I know what you mean, Art. What? Oh, nothing, Maria. Just a bit of mild head trauma. Not the first time. That isn't a surprise. They really use ropes to tie us up. That is rubbish. I'm already out. Is that a record? I think it's a record. You know what? I think it is. Now let me get you both untied. I need no assistance. Yeah, I'm good too. Huh. Well, uh, then we should probably... Oh, no, 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 no! What? What is the... Oh, crap. It's night time. Indeed. I was wondering when you'd notice. <sighs> what creature was that? I, uh... I don't know. What is it, Mr. Hopkins? Pay it no mind. No doubt some foul simulacrum conjured by our captive. Simu what? It's a fake. Sir! I see it in the distance! I don't think that's a fake, Mr. Hopkins. Mr. Hopkins? Oh god, he's done a run! Stay back! In the name of the king, I order you to stay back! Please don't hurt me. Please, please, please. What the hell do we do? Nora, take Abigail and run! I'll hold him off for as long as I can. How? Do not argue with me. I am not ready to lose you again. Now run! Oh, uh, you're such an idiot. Well, I'm not ready to lose you either, so I'll figure something out. Okay? Stop wasting time and run, child. I hope you do, Laura. I hope you do. The 
time has come to face judgment, Emrys. Yeah, I suppose it had to happen eventually. <sighs> oh well. It's not all bad. At least there's stars. Wait, how did we end up back here? The crossroads of the fates. Emrys called it a nexus point? Yeah, cool. But we need to figure out something now. That thing is going to kill the doctor. Save hoping for rain. I see little we can do. There is one thing we can do. <laughs> well, you got me. And I have to admit, I did not expect it to be you. Well done. I bet the Daleks are going to be so jelly. Pretty sure that's a thing people say in this time period. If not, it definitely should be. Stalling for time will not save you. Do you know what happens when you apply a charge to gunpowder? That? <laughs> These theatrics will accomplish nothing. <laughs> what have you done? Hitting you at just below the speed of light, which allows the TARDIS to accrue infinite mass. This will not avail you. Yeah, this is definitely going to kill me. But then, that's never stopped me before. Come on, old girl. One last stand. You and me, riding off the cliffs of destruction together. Just give it one more. <sighs> Fine. Like that. I'm sorry, old girl. I really think this might be goodbye. Take care of Nora. Cannons to the left of me. Cannons to the right. Your words are meaningless. It's from a poem. You'd like it. Everyone dies pointlessly. I like it too. But I don't like what that says about me. Anyway, I suppose we should be getting on with the getting, shouldn't we? You will cease this pointless resistance. Oh no, I was actually thinking about one last futile stand. If I'm going to die, then I'd like to make it worth a song. So, to the death. To the death. <laughs> oh, Nora! You really are just full of surprises, aren't you? What is this trickery? Oh, it's so much better than trickery. It's witchcraft. Mistress of the universe, hear our plea. We are your magical daughters, separated across time, found in blood and common cause. Save the doctor for all that is good. I know you will do this for me. As my will, so mote it be. As my will, so mote it be. As my will, so mote it be. What have you done? I didn't do anything. You insolent fool! You know, you should probably get going. You'll catch your death out here. This is not the end, Doctor. This is not the end. Oh, write about it in your dream journal. Ah, oh, it seems the storm is passing. Almost a shame. The rain feels... good. Did it work? We shall know soon enough. Until then, I must prepare. I doubt Hopkins will leave well enough alone once you've left for the stars. You could come with us. I think not. I cannot walk the path you have yet to tread. Oh, what tribulations and transformations await you. I fear for you, child. Both for what I see, and what remains hidden. For now, what I can say is this. Embrace change, and beware the black-eyed men. Well, you didn't need to tell me that last part. No, child. They're more dangerous than you know. Even the old ones fear them. Ding dong! Avon calling! Ah, it seems it did work. Ooh, you almost took me off my feet there. If you ever do that to me again, I'll kill you. Duly noted. Thank you for the life-saving and everything. 
rather creative use of ancient linguistic technology. Magic. Yes, magic. Either way, thank you for saving me. Both of you. All in a day's work. You were needed, Emrys. The shadow follows your every step. Do not let it consume you. I'll do my best. You know, I saw Hopkins gathering men on my way here. You should come with us. I'm needed here. I will face Hopkins and make my stand. For all it's worth. You don't have to do that. I must. Do not fear. I have taken precautions. What are you talking about? How does letting yourself get killed by him make any difference? Because of this. A circle. You drew it on your arm? The trap is set. With the words, Isa kena hagala kena Isa. Hopkins will strike us both down with his own hand. Mirrored protection. You really think it'll work? A uh, quick question. What year is it? 1647. It works. Oh. I wish there was more I could do to help you. And are you? But we both have our battles ahead. Evil never truly goes away. And so we must stand vigilant. Even if those we protect hate us for it. Even if they hunt us down. We will fight. And in the end, when all is said and done, and if we stay true to ourselves, we will win.